කාලගුණය කොහොම වුණත් රයිනෝ නම් වහලට සේෆ් තමයි මුළු ගෙදරම it's it's been a wonderful wonderful journey i've i've loved every minute of it I, i sort of get quite emotional about it because um you know it, it's been it's been a tough two years um but i i know that i leave with uh, the team and every everybody in a, in far better shape than when i got here so it's been tough but incredibly rewarding and i've loved every minute of being uh, of living in sri lanka i oh, look there's 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 so much talent these young players are 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 going to be incredible cricketers for for sri lanka you know and and we mustn't forget uh, you know the, the the some of the senior players i mean dimuth karuna ratan has been outstanding in test cricket over the last over the last while so, so certainly since i've been here but i really enjoy building teams and seeing some of these young players come out and have the have the freedom to go and express themselves and 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 play to their talents has been has been so rewarding um as i say first of all identifying these young guys um with the selection panel and then being being able to give these guys an opportunity has been so rewarding and when you watch them play and you see them having good performances there's nothing better for a coach you know so i've been incredibly blessed um but i know that these young guys if if they backed and if they given the confidence and if they given the consistency in terms of selection will give a lot of good performances down the line for sri lankan cricket going forward i oh, look the, the best memory for me has got to be seeing players develop you know seeing players have have success watching dimuth karuna ratna go to number 7 in the world you know and and get and and become a prolific test match cricketer watching our young players develop watching our white ball team transition from from a team of young dynamic players watching guys like winindu hasaranga uh charith patum uh danajay de silva um you know th- th- there's there's so many players i can mention and and, and i think the players ha- have have improved so much over the last while just with some some backing and just with some confidence you know and and the, the talents there that these guys just need to be backed and you know if i go back 2 years it's it was tough because of the of the challenges in the world you know i haven't been back to australia since i started with sri lanka i haven't i haven't seen my daughters since november 2019 um but that was part of the journey and 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 that and that is will forever be my bond with with, with sri lanka and then helping the players through this time it's been tough bubbles and you know we've gone from bubble to bubble to bubble and that plays on your mind so much and just to see the maturity of these players and just to see how they've handled themselves just to see that how they've bought into everything that I've wanted them to to buy into has been has been so rewarding and again I leave with so many so many fond memories well well were you right the, the game did seesaw and after day 1 I thought we were in prime position and then and then you know they they knocked us over the next day and then they themselves had had a really good partnership we did know though that wickets fell in clumps yeah it was tough to start once you got in it became it became a lot easier to bat so i i think ramesh mendes a spell certainly in the first innings brought us back into the game and a, a lead of 40 was was not insurmountable because it looked at uh, it looked to be a lot more than that and then danajay at the silvers innings was simply outstanding on on a pitch like this um the ease with which he played was uh was incredible and and it just shows how talented he is that for me was the the defining moment because we knew that once we got a lead of 250 our spinners would do the job for us so that innings of danajay de silvers was was paramount and it and he couldn't have played it without lasit uh, brian lara in boldenia at the other end so it was uh, it, it was a fantastic partnership but the stand out for me ramesh mendes in the first innings um making sure that their lead wasn't too big and then the innings of dana jay de silva just put us in the prime seat I uh, look look uh, the one thing he does do and is he spins the ball he spins the ball really big so we've just had to work on more on him being more and more consistent with his with his lines with his lengths the attacking lines that he that he bowls so 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 that's kind of what we've worked on 
But I was actually sitting talking to Grant today, and we, we, we were just watching the guys out in the field. And we said, which player out there has has really made an impression on you? And and for both of us, Ramesh Mendes, because Ramesh Mendes has toured with us almost since oh, since I started over two well, years. He's you. he's toured with us. And every tour, he hasn't played many games at the start, but every tour he'd be the guy that was training the hardest. He always wanted more and more throwdowns. He always wanted to bowl. He was always working on his fielding. And I just think he's getting his just rewards now, Andrew. So I couldn't be more and more happier for him. He's, a, he's, he's an attacking cricketer. And he's certainly going to be an asset down the line for Sri Lanka. Look, I, I, I think I, I think there's a few, uh, and and the one thing we've tried to do, uh, Andrew, is, is try and is try and create depth in in every department. So we've travelled with, with with quite a few quick bowlers at times, um, and it's you know principally because we we can't get net bowlers, so we've travelled with a big squad. So we've worked on some young bowlers. This um. This this Ch Chamika that that's I call him Chamika Junior Chamika Gunasakara I think um, he's he, he's he's really impressed me he's come in here he's been fantastic so him and Dilshan uh, Madashenko bowls left arm two two really good young young quicks in the in the wings um, you know the, the the spinners that we've had the, there's three played this game we've got Sandy Can and then in in uh, white ball cricket. I mean, Wanindu Hasaranga and Mahesh Tikshana. Seeing those guys come through has been has been incredibly, incredibly rewarding. And then the most important part for me was that when when I came in was apart from the usual standout guys, you know, the, the senior guys, Angelo, uh, Dumuth, Chandy, to to a point, um, we, we we battled to find some young batters, and 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 th that that was for me was the biggest. Um, the, the biggest in, during lockdown was was trying to trying to identify some young batsmen that we could we could bring into our setup, and then to to eventually fund um, Patum Nasanka and Charith Asalanka um, is 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 amazing. And I look at our batting lineup now in 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 both forms, whether that be white ball or or red ball. We are we've created depth there, so. The team is in such a such good shape now. Um, you know, whether it's white ball and you have the likes of Avishkas and you know Danushka will be back, Dick Wellers, um, Kusil Mendes, we haven't even mentioned. You know, there's there's suddenly a lot of fight for places that there wasn't uh, two years ago. And 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 I, I guess that's what I'm gonna hang my hat on is the fact that we've created depth now in every department. Those conversations with me and Dunajaya started at the 2020 World Cup. Um, you know, it, it 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 was clear that with with Charith coming through, with with Patum going to the top of the order, um, that 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 Vishka playing quite nicely and sliding down to number four, we were kind of being squeezed out of positions for Dunajaya in in uh, only in 2020 cricket. Dunajaya remains um, a, a key part of the team in in 50 over and in Test cricket, but. But 2020 cricket is is the one that we've tried to challenge Dunajaya. We've tried to we've tried to work on him expanding his game a bit. So those conversations started during the 2020 uh, World Cup when it was clear that he wasn't going to get too much game time. We we started prepping, we started training, we started getting his mind ready for this Test series. Um, and and you know it, it it was a tough time for him because. He had gone there full of expectation, and, and then and then not to play was 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 disappointing for him. But he took it on board, and he worked tirelessly at the world uh, at the the 2020 World Cup to make himself ready for this Test series. And the innings he played, um, I said earlier in the press conference, the innings he played here is is one of the better innings in terms of pressure of match situation and in terms of pitch condition that I've seen. It, it was it was quite remarkable and. And that's testimony to the amount of work he's put in, but also also testimony to his talents and what a what a good and wonderful player he is. Oh, look, it, it's kind of the advice, Rex, that that that, that we've been we, we've been trying to give our guys all the time. You know, I, I find, I, and I, I think I said it at at some point, and I think the Indian tour it might have been. You know, I find social media incredibly distracting for the guys. Um, there's there's a there, there's a really passionate fan base here that that. You know where, where the emotions rung high. It's it's you know it, it's very much like like it was in Pakistan and in India and, and places like that where when you're riding the crest of the wave and and performing well, you you build as a as a king and then and then when it doesn't go that well for you, everybody's on your back. So 
Yeah, uh, we, we've tried to create a culture within our team where behavior expectations are, are, are controlled and, and people understand what the expectation is to be a Sri Lankan cricketer, particularly with our young players. We've tried to educate them in, the, in that regard. And the quality of guys that sit in that Sri Lankan dressing room is, and you know, I, I'm going to get really emotional tonight when, when, we, when we eventually say farewell, because the, the characters that are in that dressing room are, are remarkable. They are really a wonderful bunch of bunch of players and um, and bunch of people first and foremost. So uh, I just want them just to just to stay out of trouble, stay on the stay on the straight and narrow because a lot of them have very big futures. Stay on the ball with the Papua Sports News Alerts. Don't miss out on everything that happens in the world of sport. Type the Papua and Centre 678 to register. 30 rupees per month. Conditions apply.